God created black people and black people created style. The name's Miss Raj. That's R O J. Thank you, and you can find me every Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday night here at the Bottomless Pit, the watering hole for the wild and weary, which asks the question, is there life after Jerry Curl? Yes, if they be black and swish, then the PP has seen them, which is not to suggest that the pit is lacking in cultural diversity. Oh no. There are your hinge queens, white men who like their chicken legs dark. And let's not forget Los Muchachos de la Neighborhood. But the specialty of this house is the snap queens. We are a rare breed. For, you see, when something strikes our fancy, when the truth comes piercing through the dark, well, you can't just let it pass unnoticed. Oh no, darling, you must pronounce it with a snap. Snapping comes from another galaxy, as do all snap queens. That's right. I ain't just your regular oppressed American Negro. <laughs> oh no, 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 I am an extraterrestrial. And I ain't talking none of that shit you've seen in the movies. I have real power. Yes, I was placed here on Earth to study the life habits of a deteriorating society. And child, when we talk in New York City, we are talking the queen of deterioration. Miss New York is doing a slow dance with death and I have come to warn you all. But before I do, I must know. Don't you just love my patio pants? <laughs> Annette Funicello immortalized them in beach blanket bingo and I have continued the legacy and my go-goes. I realized white after Labor Day is very gauche. But as the saying goes, if you've got it, flaunt it. If you don't, flaunt it and snap to death any bastard who dares to defy you. <laughs> My demons are showing. Yes. My demons live at the bottom of my Bacardi and Coke.